Hey everyone, welcome back to our weekly updates on all things about your favorite stars where you get the best of both worlds. This week, we celebrate a new baby, huge milestones, some why and her comings and goings and many more. If you want to know about it, let's get started right away. Hey everyone, welcome to Trend Street. Greg Rickard hits the 20 years milestone as the cast of The Young and the Restless this week. Joining the show in 2003 as Kevin Fisher, he has come a long way. While he did feel a little tone deaf celebrating his milestone with the whole sag after strike, he feels it's okay to celebrate the good while being fired up to fight what's unjust. In his Instagram post, he wrote, 20 years ago today, this Yahoo debuted on YR. Feeling lots of gratitude as I celebrate two decades of work on two soaps with hundreds of fantastic collaborators. And a huge thanks to the incredible days and the young and the restless fans. He really has come a long way, and we saw him grow into the beautiful person he is today. A huge congratulations to our fave, Melissa Claire Egan for her newborn baby. She and her husband, Matt Catrasar, have welcomed their second child into the world. Turns out, he is not an August baby like his brother, because he was born on July 14th. In a joint Instagram post they wrote, Meet Jake Joseph Catrasar, and went on to add, Welcome to the world sweet boy, a few weeks early, but we're so happy to have you and call you ours and love you forever. Many congratulations and wishes came in from her co-stars as well as fans. We all are so happy for them, and once again congratulations to the happy family of four now. There are a few familiar faces coming back on screen and getting more screen time. Michelle Stafford who plays Phyllis is finally out of the hiding, ready to bring more drama on the screen and with this storyline sets the stage for two major characters return. With her, we also have Heather Stevens, portrayed by Vale Bloom, who is coming on screen taking over for Phyllis's defense. And to bring back the epic Phyllis vs. Christine rivalry, Christine portrayed by Laura Lee Bell is also coming back to Y and her screen as the prosecutor of the case. Talking of milestones, Laura Lee Bell just hit it big. Can you believe it's been 40 years since she started playing the role of Christian Blair Williams aka Cricket? For whole decades in The Young and The Restless is no joke, and I think we all agree on the fact that no one else could pull the character off like herself. Joining the show in 1983, she has grown so much. Over the past four decades, we got to see her win three Daytime Emmy Awards, countless nominations, produce and write a couple of shows and films, get married, become a mother and just see her grow as the person she is now. Plus her character, Christine, is probably the best lawyer of Genoa City. What do you guys think? This week, we lost one of our Y and our vets, Nick Benedict, that too right on his 77th birthday. We all still remember him as Michael Scott, the photographer, as well as Victor's then wife, Julia's love interest. Just a week before his death, he had undergone an emergency spinal cord surgery, which left him paralyzed from neck down. He passed away on July 14th. Although it has been decades since we last saw him in Genoa City, we never forgot him and now with his passing away, he will always remain in our hearts. Rena Sofer shared a heartbreaking loss of her family member. If you've been following Rena on her Instagram, then you know she is a big puppy lover and loves to adopt. She has fostered countless dogs in need over the years and provided them a home to live, but sadly one of her foster fur babies has passed away. She took to Instagram to share the sad news and wrote, It is with great sadness that my family has lost our beautiful Princess Carolyn. She has crossed the Rainbow Bridge to be with our other lost loves, Lola and Iggy, a brother and sister who may not have known her but will be welcoming her with open paws. In the end, she also encouraged people to adopt dogs in need rather than buying them. Rest in peace, Princess. That's all for this week. Make sure to come back next week to find all the updates of your soap stars and don't forget to share your thoughts in the comments below too. Thank you for checking this video out. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to our channel for new videos every day. Turn that bell notification on if you want to hear from us and comment down below if you've subscribed and we'll make sure to reply and thank as many of you as we possibly can.